The first concert I ever saw was at the Pacific Coliseum. It was the Guess Who with Burton Cummings and uh, just the lineup they had then. One of my favorite bands, always have been, still are. I've seen uh, the Guess Who twice, Burton Cummings twice. But yeah, 1973, I think it was. I was just a teenager and we went and saw the Guess Who and just totally blew me away. The, the Guess Who was one of my biggest influences. I came home and started playing These Eyes on the piano right away and figured it out. And, and I always sang Burton Cummings songs. He's one of my favorite singers ever. And, uh, you know, in those days you had to listen to the records to learn. So Elton John, the Doobie Brothers, uh, Steve Miller, Burton Cummings especially. I, I listened to his records and sang along to everything that he sang so I could learn from him. And just so, so great. Such a great singer. Uh, the first concert that I went to was um, a really, really great uh, Vancouver band called Ninja Spy. Um, they're, I don't know, reggae, ska, core, I can't even describe their music, but it's really, really cool. It was them and uh, a couple of other bands that were that are now completely defunct. Uh, Ninja Spy is the only one of them that's left, uh, but they just rented out a uh, Peace Arch curling rink in White Rock. Um, it's like a... Like it's probably like a 500 person venue if everyone's just standing so and there was maybe 40 people there and it was the coolest thing ever. <laughs> um, no, I was already well on my way to, uh, to sort of playing, you know, local gigs at the time. I was only 13 so it was a lot of sort of open mic night, coffee house type of stuff. But um, I, already, I already had the drive, I already had the passion and uh, it was already well underway. My sister took me to the Avril Lavigne and Gob concert. <laughs> but it did influence me to become a musician, just seeing how many people can go to a show and sing along and be that emotionally invested into one person just like playing their instrument. It's insane how much power it has. Like when you're on stage playing for people that are singing along to you, whether it's like 50 people or, you know, like 13,000 people, it's, you always get the same feeling. It's amazing. So.